with the lower limb, avoiding the perforator from the posterior tibial and also from the medial sural arterial area for your medial sural arterial flap or your flap that involves cutaneous or fascial uh, adipofascial flap involving perforators of the posterior tibial. This line is the posterior middle border of the tibia. Second line is the surgical incision line, avoiding the perforators once again that are going to be inferior to it from the posterior tibial and sural and, and crossover. At this point, crossing the tarsal tunnel, we have two perforators that are going to be in that area, crossing the uh, tarsal tunnel area, posterior border and anterior border. By section of the medial malleolus, that line uh, is to the ground. Then three centimeters from the inferior border of the medial malleolus and making also an incision that will provide abductor halusis uh, upon a rosis release. The centimeter, centimeter, going through the center of the medial malleolus, three centimeter distal to it, and extending that to the drop of the calcaneus over the origin of the abductor halusis. Precise uh, incision line at all time of the orthoplastic line, avoiding perforator and soft tissue problems.